Welcome to the tutorial for the wheel stitch. Today I'm going to show you how the stitch is done and how to create this lovely lace stitch. Start by chaining a multiple of 3 plus 1 stitch and then double crochet into the 4th chain from the hook. The 4 chains and the double crochet together form the first V uh, and you're going to work into the space uh, when you come back and finish row two. Then skip two stitches and double crochet into the third uh, stitch to create the second V um, and then chain one to create the chain space and double crochet into the same as the previous double crochet. And this is the first V that we're actually crocheting fully uh, as this is the one we're going to repeat. So skip two stitches, double crochet into the next and chain one and double crochet into the next. The same stitch I mean. And you can see how we've created three V's now, two regular ones and one uh, like at the beginning, uh, that's a little bit different. Then skip two stitches and make a V, and you're going to repeat that across the row. Um, so double crochet into the uh, next stitch, chain one, and double crochet into the same stitch. And it's as easy as that, uh, and we're going to do that until we reach the end of row one. Make sure you work into the very last stitch on the row with a full V stitch, double crochet into the last stitch, chain one, and double crochet into the same stitch. This is how row one looks uh, when you've finished it. Uh, we're ready to start row two. Start row two with chain three, counting as one double crochet on the uh, chain to create the chain space and then identify the first chain space you have and that's right where I'm pointing at and work the next double crochet into that space. It's the first V on row two and then find the next chain space and double crochet into that space. And chain one and double crochet into the next chain space. I mean the same same chain space. And we will now finish two uh, V's on row two and we're going to repeat uh, finding uh, the chain spaces and then uh, doing a V stitching. So a double crochet, chain one and a double crochet into the same space. When you're at the end of a row, identify the first V we created at row one and make sure you're working to that as well with a double crochet, chain one, and a double crochet. Uh, and that's actually it. Um, to continue, repeat the instructions for row two uh, to create uh, a bigger piece. And I want to thank you for watching and have a great day.